Prince Harry and Meghan Markle, maybe, are heading to the UK in May to celebrate the 10th anniversary of the Invictus Games, which means they could end up seeing Prince William and Kate Middleton. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Though, it looks like William isn't here much for the reunion. William and Kate are very nervous because whether Harry comes alone or with Meghan, there will be difficulties, and a great deal of planning is being done to try and minimize all the awkwardness and embarrassment that is inevitable, royal expert and author Tom Quinn tells The Mirror. One plan being considered is to allow the brothers to appear in public for a short period to try to show that they can at least be civil with each other. If William and Kate seem to have public perception in mind, that's because they do. As Quinn says, it's a matter of the lesser of two evils. If Harry comes to the UK in May and avoids his brother and Kate, there will be more damaging speculation than if they tried to patch things up enough to deal with it. Short meeting. I mean, ha. Huh. Anyway, this update comes as a friend of the Wills family told the Daily Beast that Catherine and William have been very clear that they want peace and quiet for themselves and their children. Harry's visit, with all the drama it will bring, will be the opposite. Meanwhile, royal author Christopher Anderson recently revealed that Harry has made several overtures recently, only to be met with stony silence, claiming that William simply doesn't have the time or emotional scope to try to handle it graciously. He believes that his brother betrayed not only him, but the entire royal family. Prince William and Prince Harry have finally been able to end their bitter feud after an in-depth phone call between the brothers, but Meghan will have the final say, according to a royal expert. King Charles and Princess Kate's cancer diagnosis could bring the family back together after one of the worst public royal rows ever, royal expert Richard Fitzwilliams.